So the role of the teacher has clearly changed over time and, and even uh, within different countries around the world you'll see uh, individual teachers taking on different roles within the classroom. Uh, in, in my view the teacher should be not so much an imparter of knowledge or a knowledge transfer agent because uh, teaching really is not really about uh, just passing knowledge over because you don't need a teacher to do that. You could read a book or you could go on to the internet. So I think a teacher is much more about having a facilitator, someone to inspire young people to want to go on to, to be an expert in different fields but also to help guide them through quite a complex a complex world of learning and and uh, you know joining up uh, different young people so uh, you know people with similar interests uh, or, or interests that uh, complement each other so that they can actually spark off each other and learn in that way so I, I very much see the role of the teacher as a, a facilitator rather than an imparter of knowledge. Well if we think about one of the changes that's happened over the last 20 or 30 years the boundaries between subjects are starting to fall away you see that particularly in higher education where interdisciplinarism is it is the is the you know the big buzzword of the of, of the of the century in many ways and and you know this idea will probably come down into the school sector as well where actually it becomes less about the maths teacher teaching maths and more about the maths and the physics teacher and the English teacher actually working more collaboratively uh, to be able to deliver a more holistic uh, curriculum so I think that communication between teachers and that collaboration will be increasingly important as we move forward.